YouTube, we are back with Project Life. Uh, as promised, the second video regarding the uh, blanket weed removal. Uh, as you can see, still full of blanket weed. But, I'm going to talk you through how I remove it and what chemicals and procedure I use. A little bit of blanket weed uh, that was floating around the top of the pool. Still loads in there. Uh, I move that. I remove that bit simply because I don't want the uh, the pump to get too clogged up when we treat the uh, the water and uh, all the blanket weeds that ends up in the filters. Well, let's get the problem sorted and hopefully we'll uh, see some results. This is the product we are going to be using uh, to get rid of the blanket weed in this pool. It's called uh, No More Blanket Weed or TAP. Here you go. Uh, the link in the, there's a link going to be put in the description for this product. Uh, so if you want to read about, read about it a little bit more. Uh, just a few things, a few safety tips on the back. One kilogram tub, and it tells you there that it's one spoonful of this per 65 gallon, 300 liters of water. Um, and these are spoon inside the little spoon. I'm also going to be using what's in this tub. It's not the same stuff. It's just, this is actually just salt. And it's in there, just normal salt. So we're gonna actually salt the water as well. Um, probably not grow enough of that really. Could use more of that uh, in this size pool. One kilogram tub. Probably could use three of these to be honest. But I'm gonna see what we can do with these products. Right, first things first. Calculate how much water is in this pool. And to do that, there's a little calculation uh, that I found online, it, it, it's common, common calculation, simple way of doing it, basically it's times the length, by the width, by the depth, on average, and it gives you a cubic feet, um, and then you, from there you can work out uh, how much water is per cubic feet. Right, so this one is 12 feet by 3 feet, by 1.5 feet on average depth. Very small pool um, compared to some koi ponds. Uh, very small, not a lot of water at all. So it should be quite easy to work out. So 12 times three times one and a half uh, is 54. That's 54 cubic feet in there. And then Every cubic feet equals 7.48 gallons of water. So every one cubic feet equals seven, average 7.4 7 gallons of water. So it's a simple calculation again, which is 54 times 7.48, uh, which gives me 403 gallons of water in this pool. I told you, a very small pool. 403 gallons of water in this pool. Now, the instructions on this tell me that it's one spoonful for every 65 gallons. So another quick calculation is roughly six, six and a half spoon falls of this will do this pool. Yep, that's what it says. So, we're going to do that now, I'm going to show you how I'm going to do that, how I'm going to distribute it around the water. We're going to be using a bucket, quite simple, and uh, I'll show you that now. Okay. Buckets. Just a bucket up the water at the pool.
is one flat spoons, two. a little bit off okay I'll just show you what water we're gonna get a mixer we're just gonna get a mix up for a second We're going to take the salt. To pull the salt in. And this is a little swish. And again, let's do it a little bit on the edge. Salted it, put the chemicals in, all on a murky colour. Okay. Again, just a quick recap on this. Will be a link in the description. This one was just salt. This is the one 
confusing. Okay guys, I've treated the pool with this chemicals. As you can see there. Uh, let's give it a few days and get back to you and see what the result is. Okay, YouTube, we are back uh, with the treated pool. Uh, it's been about five days. Um, just going to show you now how we get on. Uh, just flip the camera around. There we go. A lot, lot better. A lot, lot clearer. See the fish. Really windy today. Still got some blanket weed. It's been about five days, but a lot of it's cleared up. A lot of it's cleared up now. Really windy here today. It's making it a bit hard to sit through the water. Let's see what happens. Yeah, guys, I think the treatment's been a success. Um, I'm pretty happy with the result. Uh, as I say, it's been about five days. Um, the uh, stuff that I took out when is still on the shovel. I do recommend that you take uh, as much as you can off the top, just to save uh, the filters uh, getting clogged up, the pump getting clogged up. Um, it's a big help. Uh, this pool, I'm pleased with the result. Happy with it. Uh, give it another few days. Sure, it's going to keep clearing up as as, uh, as the time goes on. Anybody got any questions, please pop them in the comments below. Uh, please like and share the video. It's much appreciated. And uh, there will be some more videos on the way. And uh, thanks a lot for your time. And I'll see you soon.